Morning. So yesterday, investors digested positive corporate earnings results uh, and also considered advances made by policy makers with regards to a still virus-stricken economy. So the Dow reached record highs while the S&P and the Nasdaq closed essentially flat. The dollar is still losing value against its peers and then gold is timidly rising still. In the crypto space, we're not rising further, but it's hard to say we're down after such a massive move, right, from the upper 30Ks to the mid 40Ks. On the session, though, Bitcoin did fall about 3% from 46,400 to 45,100. Uh, but any investor who would have gotten in in the past three days would be in massive profits right now. Uh, the Bitcoin dominance index is down. We're now at 61.90. Uh, and that means that during the slight move down, alts, instead of just following, actually held on and thus just outperformed uh, versus Bitcoin. So most of the alts are happy to just stay flat. I'm thinking of Ethereum, Chainlink, Bitcoin Cash. But some of the others definitely did better like like Litecoin, Cardano, Polkadot, Zcash, and Dash. So selected large market cap coins that rose a few percent. The Google search interest for crypto and alts is undeniably picking up. So if you're looking at search terms like Bitcoin, Ethereum, alts, Cardano, Dot, etc., you'll see a clear lift off. And are, are we trying to estimate how far it will go? No. But the dynamic of increased interest is enough to validate the shift you know, in investors' perception. And it's, just not, it's not just retail investors, by the way. After Tesla bombshell news and Jim Cramer advocating for companies to get some Bitcoin exposure, uh, you can be sure that every board member member is asking themselves, should I? Overnight, we also saw MasterCard announce that they will now be allowing, enabling crypto payments. And this type of news has almost become the norm. Uh, but again, the impact of such a large payment provider enabling crypto is just massive and can't be overstated. Maybe they're looking at MetaMask. So the crypto wallet is actually earning $200,000 per day in Ethereum token swap. Uh, and maybe they're thinking, I should dip my toes into that kind of a growth or picking up uh, industry. That's it for me today. I wish you a great day and a great trading day. If you haven't done so yet, please like, please subscribe. Uh, it actually helps with the visibility, but also means you'll be updated when new videos come out.